Hi, my name is Scotty Bromfield from Rockwell Automation. I'm here today to talk to you about our Rockwell Automation mining solution and one feature in particular, which is our transfer element. So I'm going to run through a quick example of it. So what we've got is our transfer element is used to track product versus time. So in this example, I've got a conveyor belt and we've got, we're tracking product as it moves from the tail towards the head of the conveyor. I've got a vibrating feeder, which is loading product onto this point of the transfer element. And I've got a vibrating feeder loading onto the middle point of the transfer element. You can see two different colors as we're illustrating the different products that we are showcasing and tracking. I'm just going to trigger an example, which essentially issues a stop to both feeders and you see the product moving towards the head of the conveyor and we're tracking it. In this particular example, I've got a high and a low location where we are using to detect if we have a or gap on the conveyor and then what we will use is we will use a status bit to issue a change position of the chute. This is useful for our customers to optimize production with minimizing the amount of downtime and unnecessary stopping and starting of equipment. So, the switch has just occurred because a gap was detected. The product is now flowing and filling up again as it moves towards. This is very useful for our customers to minimize the amount of downtime that they need during production um, and maximize their throughput uh, in the most efficient way. To find out more, please go to rockfullautomation.com.